The newest rivalry in the NHL began this week when Calgary Flames visited the Edmonton Oilers on Wednesday night. We sent Brian McFarlane out west. That's where he spent much of his week. Who's got the best hockey team in the province of Alberta? Is it Calgary? Is it Edmonton? Right now, the Oilers can say we're on top because we won the first match Wednesday night by a 5-3 score. And little-known Dave Semenko was the star of the game, and out here, they're beginning to wonder if he's this year's answer to Charlie Simmer, a guy who suddenly emerges as a top scoring threat after several years of, well, just so-so play. Here's the first goal, the opening goal of the hockey game by Semenko, set up nicely by Wayne Gretzky. Who else? Semenko scored two goals in the hockey match Wednesday night. He got the first, and then he came through with the winning goal midway through the second period. And again, Gretzky assisted on it. And that gave Semenko six goals for the year. That's six in five games, matching his total goal output for all of last season. Gretzky setting up both goals. That serves notice that he plans to finish high on top of this individual scoring race, if not right there on top. And there was a side bet on the game. Nelson Scalbani of the Flames bet. Peter Pocklington a couple of grand on the outcome. So Scalbani is a loser. And Dave, a tip for Easterners coming west. If you walk behind the horse, wear old shoes. Brian, I'm going to lose a side bet by not following that line, except to say that your report brings us very nicely to our announcement of Player of the Week, Player of the Second Week in the National Hockey League season. It is, in fact, Dave Semenko of the Edmonton Oilers, who scored his six goals in a matter of three games. He was blank last night by the Minnesota North Stars. Leading the honorable mention list, his line mate, Wayne Gretzky, who's obviously responsible for a good deal of Semenko's success. Three members of the first place Leafs received consideration, Rocky Saganuk, Laurie Boschman, and Pat Hickey. Also in the honorable mention category, Mike Gartner of the Washington Capitals and defenseman Al Sims of the Hartford Whalers, who scored.